Yo guys, what up? This is day one in Cebu. We just got here last night. We drove from Borsik. It's about four and a half hours away. Um, we walked around a little bit last night, but we're pretty tired. So, you know, we just got a place and got some sleep. It's a pretty nice town. Um, pretty nice town from what I saw. They got nice architecture. Kind of like, uh, well, kind of like, it's like all of Romania, really, like the major cities have nice architecture, but yeah. This is gonna be the first day exploring around, adventuring, eating some food, seeing what you know, what kind of food they got around here to eat. And uh, yeah, we got this hotel, this little stay last night. It's not bad, it's pretty comfortable. Um, we got a kitchen right here. This is the bathroom. You know, it works. Bed right there. Little TV. A little balcony. I don't know. I guess you could call it a balcony. Maybe. There's not really anywhere to stand, but yeah. Nice chilly day. But that's alright. I like cold weather. So yeah, I'm just waiting on my friend to get ready and we're gonna see where the wind takes us. So we paid last night for our room. We decided to take this hotel again for another night. So this lady's waiting for me at the reception so I can pay for tonight's stay as well. Hello. Hello. Hi. Sorry, but I, uh, I must go somewhere and I'm yeah. late. No, no problem, no problem. Okay. All right, so I got that taken care of. Now I'm just gonna wait in the car. My friend's getting ready, he's taking a shower. So I'm just gonna wait for him, chill out in the car. I still got some uh, some of this, I call it stinky water from the well in Borsik. Not a well, it's a spring in Borsik. I'm just gonna drink some of that. I haven't eaten anything today. I like to start my day with some uh, water. I already got the stinky water prepared right down there. Got a real strong sulfur smell, that's why I call it stingy water. Naturally carbonated too. Almost all the carbonation is already gone though. Oh yeah, that's sure is stinky. Right here? All right, so this is the, I think it's the old center right here. Look at that. As you can see, this is some old architecture, some nice architecture. I don't know if they call it the historic center or the old center or they're both the same thing or what, but what a tripped out place.
What a nice vibe out here. It's a little bit chilly. That's all good. All right, so right now we're gonna try to get a tea. But uh, everywhere asks for a QR code to sit down. So we're gonna try and smooth talk our way into this one. Have a seat, bro. bro. It's okay. It's okay? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Should, should we try some sensory overload or should we try some sweet talk? <laughs> Yo, so we just finished up our uh, our tea at that restaurant. And uh, we're looking for a, a vape shop. My friend wants to get a vape. So, yeah. Nice sights out here. Nice buildings. Um, always feel fresh after a nice tea. Plus I'm hydrated, got the water. So, we good. Yeah. Let's go see what's over here real quick, bro. Look at these doors. I want to see what's right here real quick, bro. Give me a second. Go through this little corridor. And... Hmm. Interesting. It's another interesting street. That building up there, that building's a trip. I guess before COVID, all this, like today's Saturday, yesterday was Friday, we came out here at night. I guess all of this would be open, full of people. Now, after COVID, come out here at like nine o'clock, 10 o'clock, it's dead, dead, dead. It's ridiculous. But, uh, Right now it's around 2 p.m. and it's nice out here, pretty chill. Tripped out. Let's go check it out. So it looks like from up there on the stairs, you come down here, and there's all like these weird type streets going through these buildings. Looks pretty cool. I'm gonna check it out. See what's up with it. Restaurant right there. Oh uh, yeah, we got some stuff down here. It's a pizzeria or what? Pizza. 
All right, so we're back up here in the mountains. The same thing I tried at Dracula's Castle. Langosh. Langosh. When they got it up here, we've been looking for it for the past couple days. They got it up here. So you already know we're about to eat a langosh out here. Because when you see a langosh, you got to eat a langosh. And what it is, it's like a, almost like an elephant ear. Bro, you want with the food, for everything, man. Cream with the garlic on top. Man, it's delicious. You ever come out to Romania? You got to eat a langosh. You don't say no to langosh. And this is an interesting little spot right here. Man, ask him is the, the waterfall is further up here or yeah, is it? Yeah, he said it's 14 kilometers up. Is it next to the lake? Uh, what is it? The waterfall is here, 2 kilometers walking forward and the uh, lake is up. 14. Yes. Right here, we got our langoshes right here. Cheese, cream, and garlic. Mm. You like your langosh, man? All right, then. Got this little thing here, selling corn and some other things. You see that snowman right there? You see how cold it is up here? It's foggy. We're probably gonna come back tomorrow so we can get the views. We didn't see no views. We're gonna check out this lake though. So it's so foggy out here, you can't even see anything. We don't even know what it looks like out there. So we're gonna have to get a double dose of this. We're gonna come back tomorrow. I think once you come in the daylight and you get to the other edge, you see the nice view. Yeah. 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 Freezing in a glacier lake part one. I'm hopping right here. I think it's minus this water for sure. Don't slip, huh? You don't have any electronics in your pocket? No. Yeah, sit on the bigger one, the deeper one. 